Lake of the Woods County has a unique story and their most memorable chapters are told through their artifacts at their history museum. Reporter Sherelle Moore takes us through the building for this week's In Focus. From a real Nickelodeon to an actual working printing press, the Lake of the Woods County Museum perfectly displays what life is like up north. So it was built in 1978. Um, there's a little bit of everything. There's natural history, fishing, tourism, military. A lot has happened in Lake of the Woods over the years, and this museum has it all. It tells the stories of the pharmaceutical industry and the 1910 fire that burned down the whole town. Most of the items come from families of Lake of the Woods. Stuff that people brought over, like that's from their family that they brought over from Europe. You see the commercial fishing and then the sports fishing and the agriculture and the forestry and the fire. All those things have kind of had their impact. And since every item comes from families, you can imagine that everything has its own story. I think it really grounds the local people in their past. I think when a lot of local people don't really appreciate their past until they come in and they start looking around and they realize for some of them um, they think it's all too recent because they see things that they used and um, remember. The Lake of the Woods County Museum displays history from as early as 1910 all the way to the 21st century and as you can imagine with so much to show exhibits are always changing and rotating in and out. How many pieces do you think total you have in here? Oh there's gosh. I know. Like, you could guess. <laughs> thousands, because there's stuff that's on display, and then we have a bunch of stuff in three different storage rooms. So right now we're trying to go through and count everything and figure out where everything is, so then we can swap out the exhibits. With such a vast collection on hand, the museum is focused on growing. As time goes on, I, I'd like to see more activity at the museum. I'd like We have a new addition that allows for programming. So I hope to see um, more growth in that area, people coming for specific, you know, programs, whether it's to, uh, you know, learn about a skill of the past or you know, just a lecture. Reporting in Baudette with this week's In Focus, Sheryl Moore, Lakeland News. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.